Now then guys, welcome to Stras Gaming, I'm Luke and this is my Chelsea save from Football Manager 2020 and I just want to say thank you very much for the love that this save is getting so far. Um, I'm getting a lot of views uh, than I normally would which is awesome so thank you for that and thank you for the new subscribers. If you are new to this, go subscribe, 143 subscribers, I want to get 200 by the end of the year, I'm almost there, no 143, still a bit to go but still 200 by the end of the year, I reckon that's easy done. Hopefully, fingers crossed, if I keep pumping out the content and you guys keep liking it. So we're, we're back, and literally we are back straight after the last episode that you guys saw us play. The two losses in a row as well, Porto and Burnley. Just two games we should have won, but we didn't. So we're back straight away. We're doing Brighton, then we've got Manchester United in the fifth round of the FA Cup. This next couple of episodes are definitely going to be very close together, because the next episode is going to be Porto and Arsenal. Has to be, and then... It's getting to the, the business end of the season and the Champions League is definitely one that we need to win. So we've got to have to turn that round and also I want to do well in the FA Cup. So we're going to jump straight into it. We've got, to be honest, a day to go. I haven't really prepared myself. We've got one more day to go to get to Brighton. So let's just quickly get into this. Figure out how we're going to be rocking rocking the team. Um, again, it's, it's been a while since I played. I'm just finding, not really finding the right time to record and stuff at the minute. And that's... Becoming a bit of a problem, so it means I'm not releasing content daily, which I used to be doing at least five days a week. I am struggling. Yes, I'm playing. I am doing a couple of streams with some other games as well and stuff. Escape from Tarkov is a game I'm absolutely loving at the minute. It's just distracting me enough from Football Manager not to do my recordings, which is annoying. But I will have some Escape, escape from Tarkov videos if you like watching that sort of thing. Will be on the channel soon. I'm going to start to edit some of them tonight. Hopefully get... Just some some highlight videos up, pretty much. All right, here we go. So I think this is going to be how we're going to rock. I think we're just going to just going to go with this and see see how it goes. So how we're going to rock? We've got Domaruma, James Delit, Christensen, Chilwell as the back four, Kante, Antonio, and well, Kante and Antonio in the midfield too. Kies and Mount Sterling and Hanlon up top. I feel like that's a very strong squad to be honest. We will jump in. We need to win. I realise I didn't show you the league table. We are still top of the table. I think only by three points now. If if memory serves me well, that we're still top by three points. But we'll we'll soon see. I can't actually remember. But again, we're, we're coming back trying to defend the league. Yeah, we're top by... Well, actually, no, not even by three points. Um, it's <laughs> If we don't win, we'll be on level points. So we need to win. It will be three points clear of Arsenal. And then that Arsenal game is going to be a big game. It really is. I think that game is going to be one of the ones that decides who is going to be winning this league this season, whether it's going to be us or them. We do have a better goal difference. So if we say we lose against Arsenal when we play them and uh, that's the only game and it comes down to that and we all just win the rest of the games, it should be fine. But we've got a free kick at the edge of the Brighton area. Reese James steps up, takes it. Hanlon's there though. What a finish that was. 20, well, no, not 20, 19 goals for him this season. Tammy Abraham is just being completely, not, not completely kicked out of the squad. That's a bit harsh, but... Not really seen a lot of football as of late. And that's just a lovely little scissor kick from Hanlan. My mouse sensitivity is really, really high. Obviously, that's just because of playing Tarkov. Right, another highlight for us. Kante picks the ball up, plays it to Reese James, crosses it in. Hanlan to Chiesa. Chiesa can't get the cross back in, but Reese James can. But it falls all the way back out to actually chill on that left-hand side. Marcus Antonio is actually doing... Really well. We have a chance. It just comes falls to Chiesa. He can't really do anything with it. And then Hanlon has a swipe. Again, can't really do much with it. They clear it. But Sterling now picks the ball up. Still Sterling. Still going. Gets the cross in. Hanlon for his second goal. Goes out for a, goal, uh, a corner kick. Hopefully. Mason Mount looking for anyone. Kante picks the ball up. Kante with a shot. Again, it's just a, a goal mouth scramble. 14 shots for us. Only six on target. And it's been a bit messy this first half it really has all right that's the first half done um i'm happy with your performance we are winning we should be winning by a lot more but i'll just let the assistant do the rest not bothered um we need to look at conditioning wise as well reese james and chilwell looking a little bit tired mason mount as well probably needing for the fa cup game probably spring on beak in a minute Right, 60 minute mark. I'm going to do that. I think I'm going to take off Reese James, bring on Tamori on that right hand side, and then take off Mount and bring on Beak. Again, a couple of these players have come to me wanting to play more football. I think Beak's definitely one of them. 
uh, wanted to be starting. Chiwell as well, looking very tired there. I don't think I've actually got anyone on the bench that could maybe play in Chiwell's position. Now, that's probably could be a problem. Right, tomorrow with a free kick. Passes it to Marcus, to Beak. Switches it to Chilwell. Picks the ball up. He's on a yellow card. Tries to get across into Sterling. Back to Chilwell. Again, Hanlon probably should have done better there. That's at least three chances he should have had. Has any... Is there anyone on the bench? There's no one on the bench that can play for Chilwell. That's going to be a problem. I'm not going to make the change just yet then because I can just see him picking up an injury and that'll be a big, big problem. Right, time is ticking away quite nice. I think Chilwell's going to be all right. I'm going to give Abraham a chance. Just get him on the pitch. Obviously, four or five minutes isn't going to be enough for him, but maybe if he had a couple of them chances that... Oh, my God. How on earth that didn't go in? That was very, very lucky. But a couple of the chances that Hanlan had would have Abraham kind of taken him 21 shots, 10 on target. That was so close. I don't even know how that didn't even go in. It wasn't intentional. But I think we've got this one in the bag. We're still three points clear, but we should have done a lot, lot better. Now, that was a bit of a let off. I think it was. I think the team is looking a bit tired. We now have got 11 days 11 days until the Manchester United game. Well, that is annoying, so just bear with me while I get to the Manchester United game. Right, so here we are then, the Manchester United game, the FA Cup game. How are we going to do? Uh, I don't know. I Hopefully we win, to be honest with you. I've rotated the team a little bit. Um, we've got Lordy coming in for Chilwell. Chilwell has picked up a bit of a knock, actually, so he's not going to be starting. Uh, Christensen, DeLitt and James and Domarumu in goal. Um Chiesa's picked up an injury. He's out now for between six to nine weeks. Picked up an injury in training, which is really annoying. The midfield two is going to be Mason Mount and Kovacic. Pulitic is coming in on the right-hand side. Beak, Aziz, the youngster, is going to be signing. And Abraham up top as well against Manchester United. It's one of these games. I just think we, we could do... Well, we need to win. We, we expect to win. I'm going to tell them expect to win. I want to get into the next round of the FA Cup. Um, I'm stressing the team out. There we go. Let's not stress them out. There we go. It's fine. We've got this. I just hope we've got it well. I've paused it. Don't want to pause it, do I? Let's just get into it. Come on. Right, first highlight. Mason Mount. Oh, not Mason Mount. What am I on about? Abraham even with the header. And goes very close in within the first 10 minutes. Manchester United now have a free kick set piece and it's bundled in. <sighs> it's going to be one of these games, I think. It's going to be one of these games. We've hardly had any possession as well. 32%, 68% Manchester United. We had that one chance with Abraham at the beginning. It's just one of these. The ball manages to go through four of our players and our goalkeeper and somehow ends up in the back of the net. Now, that is just a bit poor. But Reese James, nice little uh, tackle there. To Pulitic, who then does a nice back heel back to James, and we just then give the ball away. What are we doing that for? Mason Greenwood with the chance. But look at this Manchester United team. Martial, Rashford, Greenwood is still there. Lindelof is still there. Um, again, obviously, we're only, what, is this our fifth year? I think it is our fifth year. This is what I only wanted to do five years, and we're doing well. Mason Mount gets tackled. Kovacic, I thought he was just going to unleash a rocket, then Mount to Aziz. Play it out. Why to Lordy? No, we lose the ball. A little bit too much play there. Maybe it's a bit of inexperience between the left-hand side. Definitely if I was Manchester United, I would be working down our left-hand side, especially with Lordy and Aziz. Obviously, I've not, I have noticed Rashford has scored. I've been trying to sign Rashford all throughout this save. And it just obviously comes down our left-hand side, their right-hand side. Martial, just nice, easy cross. And look at that. There is no one marking. What is Reese James doing all the way over at that side? Not marking Marcus Rashford. We've only had one shot as well. And Aziz has picked up an injury. Let's just get Sterling on the pitch. Probably needed, to be honest with you. Um, this is not good. 2-0 down. Demand more. We need to pull something out of the bag. And we really need to do it fast. And it's going to be another chance to Manchester United here. Teeny with the cross. We managed to clear it. But what is going on here? What is going on? Pulitic having a poor game. Kovacic not having a great game. Right, Doma Rumor. Find Sterling. There we go. Sterling needs to have a big game now. A goal just before half time would be awesome. Right, beak to mount. Can we muster up just one last chance? We can. Pulitic just 
Nah, Pulisic's coming off at half time as well. I've decided I'm bringing on the youngster, the wonder kid, Mason Greenwood. Though what a chance that was from Mason Greenwood. And they they've won a corner. As long as we don't concede in this corner, it should be all right. It should be. We're two 0 down at Old Trafford. It's not going to be all right, is it? Right. Aggressively say, I right, show me something else in that second half. Pulisic is going to come on. The youngster is going to, the youngster is going to come on for it. No, come on, make this flimming change, please. Here we go. What do you want to be? Put you. There we go. We'll have two inside forwards on the pitch. Abraham up top, also struggling. Maybe get Hanlan on at some point. I've got to make these changes early. I'm going to go attacking as well. Demand more. We've got to do something. We've only had two shots, in fact. Hanlan's coming on as well. And then I'm going to go shoot on sight. We haven't really shot, have we? Let's just a bit more direct. Um, attacking width. We'll go a bit wider, even though I know we've got the inside forwards on. We'll see if this manages to make any changes. Probably won't, but we'll see. Right, let's just close them down now. Get the subs on early on. Unless we manage to get a goal and then maybe not do the change. No, what I am going to do the changes. I really am. They're just going to pass it around the back now. And we really need to just, just try and win this ball. Get it out. Get the subs on. And we'll be fine. Juan Basaka as well. Running down that wing. Slide tackle comes in. Kovacic clears. And what's going on here? A penalty review. What's the penalty review for? Are we going to see it? No penalty. Okay, that's fine. No penalty. Wondering what the hell was going on then. Right, I can't do any shouts yet. So, show some show some passion, please. That's what we need. I'm going very attacking. We've only had seven shots. We're going to be knocked out of the FA, FA Cup. And this season is just going from bad to worse. Ah, Manchester United have just knocked us out of the FA Cup. So, it looks like... If we don't beat Porto in the next episode, all we're going to have to challenge for is this uh, Premier League. And there we go. There's the icing on the cake. 3-0. I just... 